Hi, I'm Dakota Tangredi with Marion County. I work as a waste reduction coordinator and I help folks reduce, reuse, repair, and recycle in their daily lives. This video series is about the story of trash in Marion County, both in how you can reduce the amount of waste you produce and what happens from your curb all the way to the end of the process. Let's learn more. Today, we'll be learning all about waste reduction. So what is waste reduction? It means reducing, reusing, and repairing all of the materials in our life before we recycle. So things like sewing kits to repair our clothing, ditching disposables and single use items for other things so like reusable coffee cups or takeout containers, right? And so all of these actions can help us reduce the amount of waste we generate in the first place and design waste out of our lives. So let's use this single use coffee cup as a waste reduction example. Unfortunately, here in Marion County, it's garbage because it has a plastic coating on the inside called wet strength. So we can't recycle it. This coffee cup might not seem like much, but if all the residents in Marion County were to have a cup of coffee a day over the course of a year, we'd have 1.26 million disposable cups in the landfill. With a simple, sustainable, and durable switch, we can avoid all those cups. One place you can reduce waste in your own life is while grocery shopping. We're here at Life Source Natural Foods with Ginger, and we're gonna learn about common ways you can reduce waste while out and about shopping. Ginger, can you tell us a little bit about Life Source? Yeah, hi. We are an independent grocery store located on South Commercial in Salem, Oregon. We've been open since 1994, and we are here in the bulk department today to talk a little bit more about that. Could you talk a little bit about the benefits of your bulk section and maybe why it's great for customers and waste reduction? Yeah, no, it works out great in both a convenience aspect and that if you have a particular favorite container that you love to store your honey in or your rice or your tea, whatever it might be, you can bring that in. So long as it's nice and clean, you tear it up at the registers and then you bring it back here and fill it up as much as you like. And if you're just looking for a tiny bit of something, it's kind of handy because you can just get a little teaspoon of that thing you just need for one recipe, like cream of tartar. How often do you use that? You reduce waste and it's also pretty good on your wallet too because you're only buying how much you need, right? Exactly, yeah. Or if you see something new and interesting, like we have some really fascinating different types of rice alone mm. and it can be fun to just try, you know, a half cup or a cup of something, take it home. If you don't care for it, you didn't waste that much on it. So what are some other unique offerings here that you have to help reduce waste or do more bulk? Yeah, one of the more unique options we have is personal care items. So right behind us, actually, we have the Oregon Soap Company brand brick soaps, and you can cut as much or as little of any scent of soap that you like. Around the corner, we have some liquid soap offerings, both from Oregon Soap Company, Dr. Bronner's, and several more brands. We have beeswax, if you're into making some of your own cosmetics at home, like a lip balm maybe, mm -hmm. and you can get that in you know teeny tiny little portions or a larger chunk. If you like making your own candles even, the possibilities are really endless. Right on, I love that there's so many different ways, again, not not just from food to personal care and other options for reducing waste. So Ginger, we're at the bulk station. How does this work, especially if someone's done something like forgot a container or they want to use a setup for the first time? That's okay. We offer a lot of different options for sizes of new containers if they'd like to buy something, or we offer paper and plastic options. We've got containers, we've got bags, all sorts of options. We have a little clean scoop station, use scoop. You can use tongs for those fluffy, hard to grab herbs as well. So long as they're putting the bin number on there, they're good to go. Love it, hygienic and easy to use. That's the idea. So. We've learned about different ways and sustainable swaps to reduce waste in your own life with Life Source Natural Foods. If you want to learn more and get connected to your community, you can take the Marion Resources Movement, which is a free training talking about all the waste reduction tips and tricks for you to reduce waste in your daily life.